Notes Plus not only lets you draw, take notes, and record audio, it also helps you keep them organized. Your notes are stored in notebooks, each with as many pages as you need. The Notebooks button lets you see and organize the notebooks you've created, as well as easily create and name new ones. This Notebooks panel stays open when the iPad is in landscape mode, so we'll do the demonstration that way to make it easier to see what's going on. Notes Plus tells you which notebook you're currently editing in two ways. The title is at the top of the screen, just tap to edit it, and the Notebooks icon shows an open book rather than a closed one. Notebooks are sorted alphabetically in the notes list, but you can organize them yourself by putting them into folders. To create a new folder, tap the Add button, then give it a name. You can create folders inside of folders inside of folders, so you can easily organize notebooks however you'd like. And navigating your folders is easy. It's just like looking through the files and folders on your computer's hard drive. If you navigate down to the notebook level, you can go one step further and see your notebook's pages, but only if that notebook is currently open. Just tap on the arrow to the right of the notebook's name to see the pages. You can delete a single page, a whole notebook, or an empty folder by swiping across it and tapping delete. To work with more than one item at a time, tap the edit button in the bottom right corner, then check off the items you're interested in. You can delete, copy, move, or write protect pages and notebooks, and you can even reorganize pages within a notebook by dragging them up and down the list using the handles on the right. Edit mode also lets you rename notebooks, folders, and even pages with a tap. To copy or move a notebook or page, check it, then tap the blue folder icon and choose Move or Copy. This will switch to a destination picker that lets you choose where you want to put it by tapping, then pressing Copy. This also lets you make a bunch of copies of a page if you want to use it as a template. The procedure is the same for folders, but you can only move them, not copy them. When working with notebooks and folders, you can only select one or the other. This is because the lock button does a different thing in each case. For notebooks and pages, the lock will write protect your selection, though you can edit them again after choosing Make Writable instead. For folders, the lock password protects them. You can change the password in settings. There are two other things in the Notebooks panel, Recordings and Trash. These are the same, no matter if you're in a folder or viewing the root directory. This lets you get to all of your recordings and deleted items from anywhere in the app. The Recordings section gives you access to one of the great hidden features of Notes Plus an amazing audio recording tool that works across notebooks and even across apps. When you're working in a notebook, just tap the microphone button on the toolbar to add audio to your notes. The recording is automatically synced to the page you're working on, making it easy to find the important part of an audio file by going back to the page you were on when it was recorded. This even works across notes. If you switch notebooks while recording, the audio gets attached to the new notebook as well as the old one. If you switch to another app or put your iPad to sleep, Notes Plus will even keep recording in the background, and the audio will be synced to the page you were on when you left the app or turned off the screen. After you end a recording, any pages that have audio associated with them will show a triangular play button on the toolbar. Tap that to hear the audio associated with that page, or find the recording in Recordings to hear the whole audio file at once. In the Recordings section, you can also delete or export your audio using the Edit button. Tap Edit, check the recordings you want to work with, then tap the Delete button or the blue Export button at the bottom of the screen. Export will save the file so you can easily access it through iTunes when your iPad is plugged in. If you delete a recording, it's gone. But notebooks and pages are moved to the trash, where you can restore them with a swipe or clear them all with the button at the bottom. Notes Plus lets you take notes, record audio, and organize everything easily and intuitively. Many of these are brand new features, so we want your feedback. Visit notesplusapp.com to tell us what you think.